Oh, I'm sorry. Hey, guys. What's up? So I came to do a quick review. My phone is dead, so I had to do a live stream. So I'm gonna just do this live. So yesterday I went to I went to the mall with one of my friends and I went to Bath and Body Works and I got some stuff. Now the other two stuff I gave to someone. Um but at least I got this so I'm so happy because one of these is called warm vanilla sugar. I don't know if y'all can see that because this room does not have light in here. So well, I don't feel like getting up and turning the light off. And this is like one of my favorite bath and body works spray. Like, I have the big one, and now I have the small one. So if I go to the bathroom at church, like, I can just spray, 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 spray. Like, it is so great. I love this. Hi, viewer. Um, I'm sorry, you guys. I'm, I got to check my phone to see, like, talking, like, if somebody talks. So I have to see, like, the messages. Because I can't see on my laptop. So it's like, oh my God. Like, I cannot see. So, viewer, if you type something, I'm going to try and respond. So I'm going to look on my phone on YouTube. Yeah, so, like, if I go to the bathroom, I feel like these things, these things really come in handy. And this is my. Third one, my auntie, one of my aunties gave this to me for a birthday present. And um, shout out to her. Um, and it was this. And I had that, the other one, for years and never even used it. I started using it about a couple, a year ago. Oh, my God, you guys. And I love, I loved it. Um, Sorry, you guys. Right now I'm uh I have to sign out my channel. That's that's what I have to do. I have to sign out of my channel. Oh, All right. So I can see myself. I have to sign out of my account just to see. So, viewer, if you type something, I can't see. Like on my phone, I had to sign in on, had to sign out of my YouTube account. But, like, back to this, like, if I. Like, if you, these things really come in handy. Like, if you go to the bathroom, like, I, I, like, I like to spray because I, I just love spray. Now, this one was $6. I don't know if you can see that. $6. All right, so the next thing I got is... Uh, Two little small handy candles. Um, I can't buy the expensive one because those are really, really expensive. Ones. Those are like twenty-two dollars, so I'm not buying them. I buy the four fifty. Um, but this one is called Peach Bellini, and this is you guys. It smells so good. It smells just like some peaches. Oh, I'm sorry, you guys. I can't. Mm. 
$4. So, like, this was $4. Hold on. $4.56. Okay. So, oh my God, it smells so amazing. It smells so good. All right, so next is the Hawaii Ahu Coconut Sunset. So this smells like coconut. And this was $4.50. Oh, this smells. I'm sorry, y'all. Am I leaving y'all out? I'm sorry. This smells so good. All right, so the next thing I want to talk to y'all about is no, I'm gonna get on like some personal stuff. Hi, second viewer. Oh, I'm so happy right now. Okay, so um, like I said before, um, like on my laptop, I cannot see what people is saying so i have to i had to sign out of my youtube account and i have to use this and if y'all type i probably can see if y'all have anything to ask or anything like that but i can talk to y'all so like if, if y'all know like women we women like if y'all still have you know how can i put this cycle like, like Tylenol does not work for me. Advil does not work for me. No pain medication works for me except one thing: ibuprofen. This Pacific brand is the best brand. I don't care. This is like the drugstore brand, but this is the best ibuprofen I've ever had. Like, you guys, the ibuprofen is just the best. So this one is by Equate. Wait, I have two actually. Usually, like I have one. Hi, how are you guys? How are you guys? But usually, I have like um, the ibuprofen one. I like this Equate brand, but. Oh, well, I went to Dollar Tree. They start. I didn't know Dollar Tree sell jerkets. Like, I went to Dollar Tree. I was like, y'all sell jerkets now? So, I got, like, this cherry almond. I got this cherry almond soap, you guys. Oh, my God. It smells so amazing. Anything... I'm good. I'm glad that you're good. Like, I love the smell. Who loves the smell of cherry almond? Like, like the smell so great. All right, so I want y'all to know. Well, it's actually 201 um, here in Texas. But, um, well, public school, if y'all don't know, um, public school is out this week. I'm in homeschool, so I got out last week, but I wasn't like, I had like a little, I was out yesterday like all day, and I was hurting so bad that, you guys, I couldn't get up i couldn't get up so like my leg like i i can't really get up so i don't know if i have to schedule a doctor's appointment i don't know but hopefully like tomorrow i can just get up and like get my work done and so that i can just focus on some other stuff oh wow because i know like like in other states um, that usually they don't really get out, like, here, because I think, like, here, 
about the taxes, they they like to get out on time and stuff. So it's just crazy. Oh, that's about me. I did not know you were from the UK. Do you did do you watch Celebrity Big Brother there? Because I know that's like a, a UK show. I couldn't watch that on. Well, I could. I the only place I could watch Celebrity Big Brother was from YouTube. That's the only thing. And I think it was another website that you could watch it from, but I don't know. But these candles are good. Like, well, I don't know if you guys heard about this app. Um, um, let me turn my phone off for a second. Um, and then I'll get back to the um, chat box. But I don't know if you guys heard this app. It's called Hydro Hydro Coach. For Hydro Coach. For Hydro Hydro Coach. And what Hydro Coach is is that is this thing that you're supposed to you know drink water so they i think they give you goals and the goal is that you they put mine as 180 fluid ounces so right now i have been drinking water non-stop um like this bottle right here is a 16 fluid ounce water bottle so uh, if you download on Google, it's on Google Play, but I think the app has just come out. So, I don't know yet, but, um, and then there's another app. I know it's called Google Fit. So, it's like a Google it's like like a fitness thing because everybody knows like I'm trying to you know yeah you're right I never really thought of that like really I never really thought of that so as, but as everyone knows like me and my mom we have been moving but we're in our place now, so God is really good that we're in our place right now because, like, if it wasn't without God, I, we wouldn't have nothing. So I'm, I'm really happy that me and my mom has gone our place. I just have to set up my room, so I don't really know how I want my room. But I'll make sure I give y'all, like, a nice, like, little house tour when everything is nice and settled down and stuff. So I want to ask you guys, did y'all Hazel E? Well, as you guys know, um Cat Williams got jumped at the Benny Siegel concert. You guys, I watched the video and Yeah, I'm really trying to try that too, but you know, I I I, I try to you know I don't know what you call it. I, I don't know like the fitness terms, but but I try and I I usually like eat like like yesterday it was such a long day, so I really didn't get to eat that much, but I was just, I plopped down and just went to sleep, so. But I'm going to try and take all of y'all's advice and consideration, because I really think that YouTube people, like, really need to stick together, and I know, like, people, like, on YouTube, like, people that I have seen, because I haven't been on YouTube for that long. I have been in the YouTube on YouTube for for about four months, I think, because I started when don't when don't stop December was starting, 
And that's when I started, you know, subscribing to people that I really like. So, so when I wanted to do YouTube, what I did was I erased, I subscribed from everybody, and then I restarted my subscribe list. So I'm glad that I'm subscribed to the people that I like now because I feel like the people now is more real and like they're more. I like I like to subscribe people that have similarities like me now. Like like I'm sorry, you guys. I'm watching Bad Girls Club at the same time because I missed it on Tuesday. I'm watching Bad Girls Club right now. And it's really sad. But. Why well, that's sad. But let me turn this TV down. If I don't turn it down. I don't have the remote. I'm just going to leave it on. I have like a lot of. All right, so I turned it down. Well, to answer y'all's question about my mom, well, my mom, she's like very, she's kind of, she's those, how can I say it? She's one of those type of parents that she wants you to be, she wants me to be open-minded. So, so I think she wants me, I don't know, I think she wants me to, you know, find myself and see, she wants me to see like what I like and what I don't like. And I think she sees me like, when I, when I started YouTube, before I started YouTube, I was in a really dark, dark place, you guys. Like, I was suicidal. I used to cut myself. Like, it was crazy. So then I went to a, I want to say, like, a rehab, but, you know, people call it a mental hospital. So I went there twice, and then once I came back, you know, I went back to school, and then I left, and then Don't Stop December came on. So I was like, Mom, I want to start doing YouTube. And she knows that I've been wanting to do YouTube. I've been wanting to do YouTube. And she was like, well, Bianca, I understand. So she's like, I'm going to put you on a trial basis. So I was like, okay. And um, so now... She's like, Bianca, I see I see that you like YouTube, so I'm going to just let you do it. And my mom, she always watches my videos, so she knows what I talk about, and she looks at the comments, and she knows that if somebody, I'm the type of, I'm the type of person that, you know, there's children, different parents, because you know, children, you know, parents, you know, they like, they say, like, they would take a bullet for their child. I reverse it. I actually, I love my mom so much that actually I would step, if somebody was trying to comfort my mom, I would actually, I would actually step in front of a bullet for her. You guys, hold a point, period. I would actually get in front of the bullet because I, I wouldn't want my mom to like die. And I feel like people now really take their mothers for granted. Because, you know, you only have one mother. Step, I mean, stepmother doesn't really, you know, I know there's stepmothers out there. Shout out to all stepmothers, you know. But to me, it's nothing like the person that you came out of the womb. It's nothing like that. Because, you know, me and my mom, we're, the, we're really close. We're like peanut butter and jelly. Like, you stick us on top, we will never break apart. Like, never. And I was like, I've been playing my life. I'm like, oh, like, you're gonna me. I was like, 
to live their life to the fullest because you only have one life to live. And I'm so happy that I have you guys because you know, you know, I call you guys my YouTube family and I'm glad that I have people that comment on my videos every day because you know, I know like people always, you know, saying uh, and she this and she that well listen you guys people is going to say stuff about you all of your life like people have said stuff about my mom people have said stuff about my dad and about me and really when i before i went to mental class you guys i i kind of was really like nine times out of ten i was ten violent i was very violent very very violent Yes, I will try to come to your event on Blab. I have to. I think I made a video about it, but I haven't like posted it. Yes, I will come and make you guys. You guys, please. I I'm gonna say this. Please, please, please. You know, um, please go support S underscore Hutchinson. She's one of the sweetest ladies that I have met on YouTube. Like when I commented on one of her videos, she was the most, she was the sweetest person to me. And I'm, I, I'm proud to say that I'm glad that she has, you know, I'm glad that a lot of YouTubers have welcomed me with open arms because, you know, not all YouTubers is going to do all of that. So I, I first I just want to say thank you, S underscore Hutchinson, for commenting on my videos and welcoming me with open arms because you know i have never had that before except from you and my mom and my whole family so thank you very much for doing that for me because not everybody is going to be sweet online so you really have to watch out for people thank you so first second of all I want to talk about, you know, since this is a live stream, I want to keep this as an open conversation between YouTubers. And you guys, please come to my YouTube talk on March 26th, too. Um, it's where I, you know, all YouTubers can come and support each other. And we're going to talk about a lot of stuff that's in the media and stuff because, you know, I do look on Instagram and stuff like that. And um, I'm trying to catch up with you guys. Yes, I will stay safe. And, you know, I always have, you know, everybody by my side. So I'm glad that you guys are telling me to stay safe because, you know, not all kids, you know, stay safe. So thank you guys so, 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 so much. So please, like I said, come to my YouTube talk. Um, it's on March 26th, and it's where we talk about different topics. So, excuse me. So I want to do this as an open discussion. So you guys, y'all can comment anything in here. Comment anything. So we're going to talk, so I wanted to ask y'all about Steve Harvey. Um, I don't know if y'all watched, but the Goldman family, I think the guy that got murdered with Nicole Brown Simpson, um, his family went on Steve Harvey's show. And before I say anything, um, 
Um, before I say anything, um, I just want y'all to um, say, what did y'all think about, you know, the, the whole, you know, OJ ordeal? Because as you guys know, I wasn't born in, you know, the 1990s. I was born in the early, early 2000s. But, you know, I feel like in my generation, I feel like we don't talk, we don't talk about, you know, stuff. And my mom, she talks with, talks to me about everything. She talks to me about all the media stuff that happened in the 1990s. And says OJ, since they always want to talk about OJ every year, you know, it's not going to come out of sight to you guys. And... It's not going to come out of sight, you guys, because, you know, I feel like the Goldman family, if you guys want to hear my honest opinion, you know, my mom and my whole family have stuck by OJ, did not kill Nicole. They have stuck by, you know, saying maybe somebody said OJ up. So you guys, I did my research, and I did a few researches. You know, I did. You know. So the research that I got was, I was, like I said, you can't believe you know stuff that's on the internet. But I did try to find some stuff. So when I went on the internet, I looked up articles from the 90s about the OJ trial and before OJ and all of that stuff. So, the thing that I came up with was the man was coming to her house. I think my mom said that he came to her house to give her some glasses or something. So, um, I, so after that, after I asked my mom what she thought, I looked it up, and that's true. Uh, he did want to go to give her the glasses. Now, what they're, according to what, you know, people say is that, um, um, OJ was in Chicago. That's what they're saying. I'm sorry. So, you know, I have to, I have y'all comments because I have to, I have to sign out of my account to look at the comments. But, um, but, uh, but, you know, I do have some doubt that OJ did it or did not. Um, I do have like a little bit of some doubt because, you know, you know, everybody, like I can say, everybody say that nobody is capable of murder, not even the innocent ones, you guys. You, y'all want me wrong. Everybody, to me, is kind of capable of murder because it don't matter if you a church going person. It don't matter if you, you know, a um, whatever type person. To me, everybody is capable of murder. It doesn't matter to me. Um, but like I say, OJ. They say OJ was in Chicago, so. I want to ask, do y'all think Ronald Goldman and Nicole Brown Simpson and her family, their family, do you think every year when OJ, you know, trial, the anniversary comes up, do you think that the Goldman family is making money off of OJ, of what they say?
So I was looking at a text message, but um, it was my mom. She was just telling me something. But, uh, she was, I, th- I, you guys, I want to be honest with y'all. I'm going to be honest because, you know, to me, I'm kind of tired of hearing about OJ. I'm tired. Um, I know this is like, they call it history or whatever, but I'm tired of hearing about the OJ Simpson trial. I think people need to let it rest because OJ is going to come out in 2017 in October. OJ is going to be on parole. And I feel like OJ needs to re-switch his life. So I feel like if you guys want me to be honest, let me tell you something. I think OJ needs to leave the country. OJ needs to leave the country. And I feel like OJ needs to change. He will always be, you know, OJ Simpson, you know. But I feel like OJ needs to get out of the country and change his name. No. You one of them things of them white chicks things, them prosthetics where they make a new facial mask, dye your hair, you know, change all of that because OJ in America, I don't think he's not. OJ's now on the last. What do y'all think? Do y'all think if OJ comes out of jail? Do y'all think OJ is going to last in America? Do y'all think OJ just needs to leave the country and never turn back? Because I feel like OJ, I'm kind of scared for his life because he's coming out of prison of whatever he did. Um, he's coming out of prison in 2017. He's going to be on parole, but OJ needs to leave the country. Need to go. Um, I think you're not going to survive. Yeah. But enough about OJ. Let's get to this doggone, you know, this is because I want to be real and I want y'all to open discussion since we have youtubers on here i want everyone to comment about this cat williams you guys cat williams what is up with him like what is going on like cat sorry y'all i'm just trying to like cat what is going on Calm down. Yes, he does need help. He needs help. Um, SR Hutchinson, did you see the video of when he got jumped? Because I watched it today. And before Cat Williams even got jumped, he looked a hot mess. He I think Cat Williams had that's what I think. I think Cat Williams was high and drunk. Like, I, he was, I don't know what the heck he was doing, but he was doing all of this, and I was like, uh, he guys, he just, he needs help. He needs, he needs more than help. He needs Jesus. Like, for real. Somebody needs to lay the Holy Bible on him and tell him, Cat, you need more than help. You need Jesus. And if you watch TMZ, Hazel E has took a break. Hazel E has took a break. Hazel E said on the TMZ thing, she said snitches and something. And then she said, hey, she said me and Kat is officially taking a break. So this is y'all. I'm like, oh my god, it's so crazy. Like, real dog. 
I just love watching myself for some reason. Like, I have to, because I have y'all comments. I didn't say it about three, four times. I have y'all comments so I can see. But. You guys, Cat Williams needs Jesus. That's all I can say. So. Um, do y'all watch Sweetie Pie on OWN? Sweetie Pies? They have Miss Robbie. She used to sing with Ike and Tina Turner. Put it in the comments if y'all watch uh, Sweetie Pies on OWN. Okay. Why y'all want? Okay, so if y'all don't know about Sweetie Pies, Sweetie Pies is a show where it's a restaurant. Miss Robbie Montgomery, um, she used to sing with Ike and Tina Turner. She was one of the background singers. Um, and I have found out today on one of my sources on Instagram that her son had Andre got shot and killed in St. Louis. That was so sad because I know in the first season they said that his dad died the same way. Oh, okay, okay. okay. I get what you say. But that's so sad that No, Tulsa said that he got shot. Her grandson got shot and killed. On oh, his name's Andre, but that was so sad. I'm like, wow, y'all done went through another tragedy. Like, it's just, you know, tragedy was always um and go and. I want I want everyone to um just you know keep their prayers for everyone. And I want to say live because I'm on live stream. I already did a video about it, but I want to say to the uh Swedish traveler, um, um I I'm gonna keep my prayers for you. Um, so keep him in your prayers too, because. His grandfather died, and keep your prayers for a big dude. Cause I don't watch the video, and I think he said his cousin's dad passed away. So keep him in your prayers too. Um, and also keep me in your prayers. You know, keep everyone in your prayers because you always you no need to keep people in your prayers. Sorry, y'all. I'm itching. My head. I haven't washed it, so I'm thinking about black ironing my baby, my main. So, um, so next, I want to say that did y'all watch the haves and the have nots? And loving you was wrong. You guys, y'all have to watch that. If it's, please tell me. If one of y'all watches it, please tell me y'all watch Have and Have Nots and If Loving You Is Wrong. Please. What? Oh my God. Well, you guys, y'all gonna have to watch Have and Have Nots. That is the best Tyler Perry shows that Tyler Perry has ever done. It is out. It is out of the universe to me. Tyler Perry has done his work. But if y'all do watch it, um, 
Tyler Perry, um, Maggie, then got killed probably. Veronica set her up. Veronica set her up. Veronica set her up. Like, that is so sad. If loving you is wrong, that is my show. Like, me and my granny and my mama, we always watch it together. And after it comes off, if I don't get to go to my granny's, I always call my granny on the phone and be like, hey, did you watch it? Like, <laughs> that's how it would be like. Like, oh my God. Um, I know someone asked me on another video, um, was like, why are you not in all of this YouTube stuff? I was like, because, you know, I'm my own person. And I don't have to get in. I feel like YouTube is supposed to be drama and, you know. But, hey, you know, people just, some people just love to, like, start stuff. But. So I have an announcement. I have an announcement. I have an announcement. I have an announcement. I have a song since Sunday. I have an announcement. I have an announcement. All right. So I have an announcement. The announcement that I have is I now have my own. No, I'm starting off. I <laughs> this is called it's my last name virtualist hair extensions so i do have my own hair extension lines for if you don't know me um i'm obsessed with hair i am obsessed with hair hair is like I want to say it like this, but <laughs> I don't know. Hair is like, I don't know. I think, you know, hair is like, it's almost like a, like, if someone's like addicted to something, I'm addicted to hair. Like, I love doing people's hair. I do people's hair, you know, every Friday. And uh, I do my mom's hair every Friday. Um, so, yeah. Um, so, I have my own hair extension line. It's called Virtuous Hair Extensions. And I'm going to send some people some hair. Um, so, I want, the reason why I'm doing this as you know, it's not like I want a, a peace offering or whatever, but I want to, I want, sorry, y'all, my camera. Okay. But um, I want to, you know, I want to send somebody, some people some hair, but I got to order my samples first because you guys, you know, you can't have no uh, nappy hair. You don't want to send out no nappy hair. So, so I'm going to type something. So, this is the website. So, go look. I'm going to put the website. I don't know if I can do it on here, but. So, hold on. Hold on, you guys. Let me get off my phone for a second um, so I can see the thing. Uh, what is it? Word. Hold on, you guys.
Yep, so I put that right there, I think. Hope you guys can see. So, I don't know if you guys can see, but it's V E R T I L U S dot slash dot dot this way, this way, like a subtract sign, um, virtualist subtract sign, hair subtract sign, subtract sign. Extensions dot my u r b e m a dot com. So go check it out. So we are not having a video, but I don't want anybody to come to my video. You know, I haven't, I haven't been in that video, so I have to do my hair. But uh, I will be doing some hair because I want uh, to see what people say. So, you know, I also want to do like my lab um, but I don't know what I want to do yet as collaboration because I was supposed to do a collab, I think, but it didn't, with someone else, but it didn't work out. So, uh, but that's good. That's, you know, for me like that. Oh yeah, I have to move on with live. So I think I'm gonna finish this live stream. I'm glad that I had um I love you guys so 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 much. If you want to watch this YouTube stream, um it's already gonna be posted up. Post it, post it, post it up. And I love you guys so much. If you have if you need to talk. Please, you can always email me, you know. My email, I think I say it in all of my videos. Y'all can, I see your girl post her DM. So, <laughs> it's a DM. Sometimes DM me on Instagram. My Instagram is B-A-D-D-I-E, baddie, one, two, three, BB. BB is my nickname, so. Oh, okay. Well, I'll be back to Baddie, one, two, three, BB. I do have Snapchat. I don't remember that you remember. Mm. Oh. Let me go on Snapchat. Snap, Snap Baby Chat. I, I don't know. Yes, my Snapchat is Baby One Two Three. Twitter, Baby One Two Three Baby. Thank you guys for tuning in. I love you guys. All right. Bye.